uh, si Jesus, uh, kailangan niyong panahon, no? Panahon, kunting panahon, uh, to gain time, not to rush a decision. So, kaya nag ano siya. Tapos, second, uh, eh, papakita niya sa mga mga tao o kung ano ang mga accusations nila. So, let, they let Jesus, let them to take their decisions also, their judgments. And third, uh, he wanted to hide his face because he could not just, you know, uh, could not just, uh, ano ba yan? Uh, for you, it is an intolerable sense of shame yang hiya siya sa mga ginawa ni ng mga uh, scribes and Pharisees. Uh, and then, third, uh, ano pa? A fourth guy pala. Uh, talagang sinulat niya mismo enumerate their sins uh, you committed this you know? so nobody uh, stoned the, the woman because they were able to realize na ang dami pa rin niya pala natin ginawang kasalanan kay sa kanila sa babae na yun so that is the uh, parang historical or exegesis about that I don't know if, uh, yun lang ang nabasa ko well Oh, we're in the in the fact in our today's society, people are so judgmental. Sino lahat ko nga dun, maraming na comments yung lasalian ka na natulog dun sa baba while waiting for our nung sa Sunday na yon. Sino lahat ko the animals need also to 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 you know to to rest and deserve to be protected not unlike people in our society who are so judgmental uh, but that they can simply kill life. So, but God, God will give his life and have it to the fullest. So, yun ang, yun ang ating realization na siguro sa katikesis natin, uh, we do not judge immediately these people who do not respect life or simply condemn people who are sinners like that. But we have, like Father said kahapon, we have to know, uh, to experience uh, their situations in life. Kasi may isang teacher, lagi niyang binabagsak yung kanyang isudyante kasi natutulog. Pero, nung nalaman niya, bakit niya natutulog? Sama, sama tayo sa inyong bahay, anong sitwasyon. Di pala nakakatulog yung bata na yun. Kasi pinapalaba lagi ng, mga, ng parents, siya ang nagsasahing, ang mama lagi wala sa bahay, kaya wala na siyang magawa, ma, magawa doon sa bahay, uh, ma, ma, matutunan, no? hindi na siya nakapag-aral dahil ang trabaho lahat binibigay. So, from that, nakita ng sitwasyon ng bata, ah, kaya pala, hindi makapag-aral ito, natutulog sa klase dahil sa kanyang background, sa kanyang karanasan doon sa bahay na, siya pala lagi ang nagtatrabaho. Nag, uh, so, from that, we cannot judge, judge na, ah, bubo, bubo itong bata ito, di man aral Pero, nung nalaman niya sa sitwasyon ng bata, na yun pala ang dahilan. Kaya, yun ang yun ang sitwasyon na dapat pag-aralan, no? And, ano pa kaya, bro? Uh, <laughs> Pwede bang itutong mo ito? Kasi, oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. <laughs> for, for me, as catechist and priest, I should be more, you know, compassionate for the people, no? Not to judge them immediately. But to know there is his, his stories, beautiful stories, and the reasons why they become like that, their behaviors like that. But, so yun lang siguro, muna, to be continued na lang, di ba? <laughs>
Father. Thank you, Father. Yan ang tinatawag na midrash, no? We're trying to guess, ano ba, bakit ba nag-bend si Jesus? So even little details like that can catch the attention of the reader. And then you can ask questions, bakit kaya ganun? And then you look for other ideas, bakit kaya nagkaganun? But your, the flow of your uh, uh, thoughts should flow always from the situation itself. Wag lumayo doon. Doon sa tinatawag na pesyak. Doon sa tinatawag ng text, no? Yung ano, yung text na binabasa natin. Alright? Uh, wag masyadong lumayo. Katulad nung, ano, protikal sa mayo, tinuro ko dito sa lasal. Pagkatama sabi ko, oh, finish the story. Did the, did the elder son enter? What happened to the elder son? Because the story ended in a bit medyo bitin. One of them said, ay, lumayas din yung eldest son, ma'am. Tapos nagpakalayo din. Tapos nakita niya yung nanay niya doon sa isang man. <laughs> Kasi diba, walang, ano, walang measure yung nanay niya doon sa ano. Nakita yung nanay niya doon sa bar. Eh, ala, ang haba-haba ng kwento, pinento niya. Sabi ko, napaka-fertile naman ang yung imagination. Pero hindi ko yung tatanggapin kasi wala doon sa, ano, sa text. Yung probable na mangyari kasi hudyo siya, maaring ganito. That can be acceptable. Pero yung ilalagay mo yung sitwasyon niya sa sitwasyon natin ngayon, hindi pwede yan. Alright, so, very good. And the last but not the least, sino? Tapos na lahat. Okay, so congratulations for your initial exercise. Ganyan ang gagawin nyo. At saka, ang gandang tignan na kayo nagtutulungan. Kung yung iba hindi nagsasalita, at least nag-cheer sila. Because as we have started, when we started this course, we started with appreciative inquiry, right? So, uh, included in the appreciative inquiry also is the appreciation for one another. We don't have the same talents and we don't have the same capacities. Uh, Iba-iba yung ating capacities. Why? Because we come complement each other, we complete each other, and that is why we need each other's talent to be able to come up with a whole, no? yung uh, buo, hindi mabubuo yan kung may isa na hindi nagpa-participate. So pinag-usapan natin yung participation, pinag-usapan natin yung cooperation, pinag-usapan natin yung we are one body, and then community of communities, lahat yan dapat ipasok natin, integrate natin dito sa ating Ginagawa. So for now we have a break. Is that ano? Alright, we have a break and then continue. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.